This video we're going to work at concatenation techniques here. I have a list of first and last names. I want to join them together. So I'll go up to the formulas tab, click text, and find concatenate. All this is is just simply string together a variety of text strings that you combine. Start with the first text one we'll represent here. I've got A2 representing miles. Uh, the, uh, text two. I don't want to go out and click right yet on uh, the, their last name because look here, it's just going to say Miles Davis without space. So actually type a space bar on that second line there. And then uh, we've got the, now the opportunity now to add the last name here. That will do it. Yeah. I had to start off with Miles Davis. I've been in a big kick right now. Listening to a lot of kind of blue. Um, so yeah, that's just, uh, I had to come up at front here. Let me just bring that, uh, those down simple as that. It's so cool, isn't it? Another method is I can, uh, work with the ampersand character. There's the ampersand character. So I'll start off the formula with the equal sign. Um, let's go with the last name first. So I'll click B2. And then here we go. We type the ampersand character. What would we like after? I'll type a quote, comma, space, quote. That's just basically saying I want a comma and a space after their last name. Follow that with another ampersand to finish up with their first name. Return. And how cool is that? Get all the last names first, then a comma space and you can see that right there all right so those are a couple methods there now for those of you that have Excel 2013 watch this uh, maneuverability here this is gonna be called flash fill basically I'll just start to type Miles Davis I hit enter and then I'm going to start to type Seth Godin but after I type S, it's all set, ready to go. Here's our flash fill. I like that. I'm just going to hit the enter key, and the rest are completed. And there's uh, just straight up like that. There's no formula connected at all to it. It is ready to go. So you have to be careful about that if uh, we have perhaps a, a name change or something like that. Then let's say John over here is J-O-H-N see what happened here is um, flash fill did not update but the formulas did so put that back how it's supposed to be all right thanks for joining hope you enjoyed this and uh, stay tuned for our next one